First of all, before I begin um, the short words that I've, uh, that I've prepared tonight, I also wanted to echo a tremendous thank you to Harold and Zia for this gorgeous evening. It's just beautiful. Um, every detail, every, uh, just hours of, of, of tireless work. And thank you so much for the kind words from Rabbi Sharon. I'm, tru I'm truly, truly humbled by this honor. Um, thank you so much. Bereshut Roshe Yeshiva Rabbanim and Kol Hakal HaKadosh. It says in a pasuk that I think we all know very well, we all say it every day a few times, Devarim Vav Zayin. You shall teach them thoroughly to your children. Speak of them when you sit in your house and when you walk on the way. Rashi asks, who are your children? And then explains, these are your students. We find universally that students are termed children. We are like the children of those who have taught us Torah. It is because of this we find ourselves here this evening celebrating and demonstrating our tremendous Hakar Satov to Chappelle's and Midrashat Rachel Vachaya on its 36th anniversary. We alumni recognize that Chappelle's and Midrashat Rachel are nothing short of the Jewish home that provided us with the foundation to lead productive and meaningful Jewish lives. As a parent, therapist, and social worker, I have observed that a major key in raising healthy children is to provide clear boundaries while simultaneously being mishader imun, conveying trust. This allows a child to find his or her own way within those boundaries. Conveying trust is a way that a person internalizes a basic element of trust in Hashem's world, which allows him or her to go forward. This is what Avinu Shabashamayim, our Father in Heaven, does with us Jews. He gives us the Torah and free choice and says, go out and make the world a holy place. He relies on us to bring godliness into this world and believes that we are up to the task. He gives us clear boundaries while also leaving us many choices, including the Pesach of his own Torah. He builds in the reality of Teshuvah to allow us to grow through our mistakes and ma maintain a reality of free will. When I think about the education that I received at Midrash Rachel, I am so grateful for the Shidur Imun, the message that although you are but a Bala Tshuva, we believe in you to learn primary texts. We trust that you can figure out which stream in the Torah world suits you. And we expect you to do important things to contribute to the world. This Shidur Imun is one of the hallmarks of a Darche Noam education. As such, it is no wonder that its graduates are, are so busy contributing to the Jewish world in so many meaningful ways. Thank you for this wonderful honor. I'm like a grateful daughter to Darche Noam for giving me the nurturing environment and the tools to live my life in a Torah true manner while bringing this legacy into my work and into the next generation. Thank you so much. <laughs>